Hi everyone, Jason here from Jim's. Today I'm going to show you how to empty your skimmer basket. The skimmer basket uh, is an important part of the pool and it should be checked quite frequently for debris and stuff that's entering the suction part of the pool. So here we have a skimmer today. It's, as you can see there's leaves in there. Um, so basically the leaves will enter in through the front of the skimmer here or if you have a suction cleaner attached to it. And it's very important to make sure that this is clear so basically, depending on the type of skimmer you have, you can twist and turn between the nodules there and pull it up and you'll have debris in your basket as you can see there. Now some people ask, do I keep the system running when I do this? I recommend yes, because as you can see, all the little finer parts will go down into the suction area there. It also assists in some of the debris staying in the basket as opposed to floating so if i put that back in you'll see how it floats all back up now a little tip if you have too much debris in the skimmer there and you're struggling to get it out while the system is running you just run your fingers down the side of the basket there just to allow a little bit of suction to get through and that'll loosen it up for you and just bring it out now the important thing is is to empty the debris into a basket and as you can see there's still some debris left in there try and not tap it on the floor because you may crack the basket depending on your chemical balance and how old the basket is if it's old and brittle by tapping the debris on the floor like this or on the ground it's going to potentially crack part of the basket i'll show you in a sec how to clean the rest of that out okay so as you can see you still got a little bit of debris in there the advice i give people is just to sort of pick out the bigger bits that you've got and sort of put them aside otherwise just grab your hand and just give it a bit of a tap tap the side of the basket gently just try and get the rest of the debris out if you're a little bit OCD like me you just simply grab your, your hose and just give the rest of it a hose out grab your hose like that now what you want to be doing before you put that back in the actual basket is you want to be inspecting for any cracks make sure that it's solid and there's no actual cracks or splits in, in the plastic because if you have a crack or a split in any part of your basket that debris is going to go through the actual basket into your pump and I'll show you in another video on how to clean out your pump thanks for watching